Hey, Pan Dudes, Peter Von Pandy here. Hey, just ordered myself this perfectly vivid um, <clears throat> military grade, quote unquote military grade, uh, aluminum flashlight. And I actually wouldn't normally show you a pocket sized flashlight, but I'm actually really impressed by this one. First of all, it comes with this little Cordura pouch with a belt loop. So that's cool. You can definitely. Um, uh, wear it on you when you're camping, but I was just impressed with how um, serious of a flashlight this is. So you can see it's black, I think uh, anodized aluminum, uh, but it's it's not that heavy, but it does have some pretty uh, decent heft to it. But this thing is thick. I mean, this is a serious, I mean, if I whacked you on the head, you'd have a uh, a goose egg uh, sized welt on your head. Um, the bottom unscrews here, there is an O-ring to you make it water and dust proof. And then the battery case comes out here. And these are AAA batteries, and I have some. Looks like it takes three of them, so I was gonna go ahead and load it here. One, two, three, and kind of like this, uh, <clears throat> um, this little like uh, uh, carousel. And then I screw this back on. Uh, it has the lanyard already attached and then the power button is this rubberized button on the back and so you can see that this sucker is a seriously bright flashlight the other cool thing here is this anodized red uh, aluminum ring which moves pretty freely is adjusting the LED bulb up and down so you get different uh, spread patterns with the light so if I kind of show you here it'll be a little tough here but uh, you can either have kind of a wide um, spotlight or more of a pencil beam. So it's just kind of cool that you can adjust the beam without having to adjust the, uh, the, the whole housing itself. And as you know, you can kind of unscrew um, housings on a lot of flashlights, which is how you get the battery in. But sometimes you can pop it all the way off on, uh, inadvertently. But this has locks, so it only goes a certain distance. And it has a single uh, LED um, diode in there, which is, like I said, super bright. Now, this is a very well-lit room. Ooh. You know, if I noticed if I double-click, you get a strobe effect. Didn't even know that. Discovered that just now. So, uh, very cool there. And then uh, last thing is you have um, a little screw in orange rod here. And this is great, especially if you have to land a plane uh, in an emergency. And actually these are great for everything from parking cars to signaling to friends to uh, kind of just muting and diffusing light so that you don't, um, you know, <laughs> give everyone night blindness. But uh, you know, just a, an aluminum, uh, a black or black, orange plastic rod the the end is capped there's no opening here so that you don't get a spotlight effect but and that actually helps reflect the light back and kind of gives you um kind of uh, the diffused light and actually even though it's orange this light is pretty bright and you could even use this for kind of an improvised uh, lantern or hanging from the top of your tent to kind of light the uh lantern so like i said um just a cool uh and double click and get the strobe. So like I said, I wouldn't normally show you a uh, uh, pocket flashlight. Fits nicely in the palm, but this one was uh, particularly nice. Just a really good quality. I've had a lot of pocket flashlights in the past, including mostly the Maglite brand, but uh, this one I was just super stoked about. So wanted to show it to you. Peter Von Panda for the perfectly vivid aluminum pocket flashlight. Out.